Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to add previous and next button functionality in custom slider in my one of the video I have explained how to create custom slider I mean this video ok I give this video link in this video description let's start here I want to add two buttons this is capital N and after this sorry this is previous or uh, I change this this is previous and this is next ok and save this yeah, here we got two buttons here I want to use this button style ok copy this class and here I'm going to add class and paste this and save this yeah, here we got button I'm going to add functionality for this first I'm going to add a next button functionality so here I'm going to add handle click I mean handle next functionality copy this and here I'm going to create on click this is handle previous ok and to create two function const is that next functionality sorry and I want to create one more for previous copy this and paste it here first in every click I passing index here right I mean indexes I got index in this index so I'm going to create one state to store index okay here index in okay or uh, well set val and here initial values 0 okay and I am going to copy this every time this button is click or uh, I'm passing this index value copy this and paste it here and I am going to add next button functionality ok here I am going to copy this val first ok before that I am going to create one variable let index ok here I am going to paste that value val this val index value ok index less than less than this image length I mean here we got 3 image ok less than dot length minus 1 because total length is 3 3 minus 1 is 2 we got 2 indexes ok 0 1 2 yeah totally we got 3 index and if this condition is satisfied I'm going to add val plus 1 else I'm just pass this val okay. because if this length is reached 2 I mean 3 we don't want to add plus 1 okay we are going to stop in the last position I mean last index here I am going to copy this I mean I am going to set the index ok here I am passing this index here and after that change in this image index also ok here I am going to pass this index copy this and paste it here and save this here I am going to refresh this page initially we got 0th index ok if I click next oh, it's sorry we need to add like this ok copy this here image index and here I am setting the image ok image value so I am going to copy this and paste it here save this here I am going to refresh this page 
here i want to click next here second value i mean it's displaying second and if i click third yeah, it's displaying third image if i click next it's not showing any image or uh, it's not breaking okay now i want to add previous button condition i want to copy the same and paste it here here i want to check this value equal to full length and i want to add one more condition here here i want to add and this val okay i mean index index is greater than zero okay we are not going to here i want to add minus we are not going to minus in zeroth index okay so that here i added this condition now yeah i want to save this and go here and I am going to refresh this page initially I am clicking this previous it is not get previous ok here I am going to click next this is current image ok if I click previous it is back to this ok if I click this one this is second index if I click back it is back to here if I click next it is going here ok yeah this is previous and next index ok here I am not get any console error yeah this is what I try to tell in this video I think this video will help you bye bye